Woohoo! All right, gang. We're out and about now. Today is my first day of graduate school, so that's kind of cool. Um, I'm walking out of my backyard. There's the car, and apparently class does not start until noon, but I am going to the business building to uh, review three lectures, and um, I also have to go get a badge from um, I'm bad at talking. I have to go get a badge from the office um, with my name and picture on it. But I did not get an orientation. Um, so, let's see how today goes. So I thought I'd talk a little bit about school. I've been going here since 2018. I graduated high school in 2018, been going here since then. Um, this program is a three plus three program. So I do three years of undergraduate here and then three years of grad school. So this year is my senior year. Um, but this is my senior year and my first year of under um, grad school so it's combined so um, we get our DPTs in six years rather than seven um, so that's pretty cool I was a direct admit here so I kind of knew I was coming here the whole time um, there's a car coming hang on it's gone um, but at the end of this year I will graduate with my bachelor's degree and then two more years to my DPT so this is exciting. This is what I've been working for. Um, it's only gonna get harder from here. Okay, so this is kind of exciting. So I got the I got the clothes on, but uh, that's pretty cool. Yay! <laughs> so I'm heading into the business building now. I'm trying not to, I'm trying to be nonchalant as I take this. Um, but I have three lectures to watch before lab today, and the door is heavy. It's very quiet. Oh, works by itself. No hands. Um, it's very quiet in here. But I'm going to do my work now. It's also very hot. It is very hot in here. Why is it so hot in here? I'm sweating. I forgot the other it. Good morning. It's day two. It's raining a lot. I'm risking my phone's life out here. Um, <laughs> it's raining. Uh, we have anatomy today from 8.45 to 1.15. No lab yet. Um, it's really cool because I get to go to a school with a donor lab, donor laboratory, um, but unfortunately the bodies have not arrived to the school yet, so we get to have anatomy for five hours. I'm going over to class, it's 8.15. Uh, class doesn't start till 8.45, but I got to class about 15 minutes early yesterday and still had to sit in the back. So I'm trying to get a good seat for class today. Strawberry is really good. Okay, I'm back. I'm sitting in bed. But today was a really good day. My hair looks insane. Um, but it was much more entertaining than yesterday. Uh, today we had anatomy lab. And we met the professor, he's really nice, he's really funny, um, and it was really good. We went over a lot of the muscles of the back. I don't think we went over all of them, but we went over quite a few. Origin, insertion, action, all that great stuff. Um, so that was good. Uh, maybe a little bit scary, but I mean, we still have yet to go into the donor lab um, and see all that stuff, so that's probably when the scary stuff will start. Um, but just taking notes and reading over our dissection book. Um, so it was good. It was so good because I just geek about anatomy. I don't know why. Like I never had any kind of experience with an injury or anything before high school. <laughs> um, I never had any family members besides my dad that was like really into it. So maybe it's just in my genes, I don't know. 
But I really fell in love with anatomy, um, you know, in high school when I could be an, an athletic trainer, a student athletic trainer. Um, I loved it in college, um, my undergraduate years. So I don't know, it was just really cool. I don't know what gets me so into it, but it's just, it's just kind of this different kind of science. I don't know, it's not, doesn't involve math. Not a math person. It's just, it all, it's like a big puzzle. And it all just makes sense. It's the big puzzle of how your body works. I don't know, I just think that's so cool. It was really, really cool. Um, I really love anatomy. And I'm looking forward to um, next Monday when we have more lecture and I get to dissect a body for the first time. Hello, my glasses are slipping off my face because I'm so sweaty. It's very hot outside. Um, but today we had our second cadaver lab. I don't remember if I said anything about the first one. Um, we had our second cadaver lab today. It was actually far harder than the first one because the first one was just taking the skin off of there's me. It's the skin off of the body. So that was kind of like simple, didn't require a lot of thought, just, you know, some mental strength to actually go in and make the cuts. Um, but that was okay. It was definitely a wild experience. And um, I really hope I don't get too used to it, but it was really, really cool. It's a very, very special way to learn. But today it was a little bit harder. Um, we had to go a little bit deeper into the back muscles. We started in the back. Um, so we cut into the back, opened the back, found some muscles, and then we had to um, reflect them. So we had to separate them from the connective tissue. And our donor is really tiny, um, very skinny. So it was kind of hard to get the muscles reflected on our donor. Um, but we really had to kind of work at them and like if you're not careful you can cut too deep Which is you know not great because then you're cutting the muscles in half um, But we are doing okay with that right now um, One particular muscle the serratus um, Superior posterior which is a muscle that aids in breathing um, that's in your back. I'm just gonna take these off um, That was it's really small muscle. It's very thin um, It's not like small in size. It's it's got like a relatively large like surface area um, or medium surface area, I guess, but it's very thin, it's like paper thin. And when we brought up the scapula and the rhomboids, um, it just came right up with it. So we were like, Ur, we didn't preserve that one. We had the, oh, we got to, we preserved the other one, which was great. Um, that one stayed intact, but then the other one didn't stay intact and we're like, where is it? So we were like, oh, it's probably attached still to the scapula. So then I was like, well, I'm going to get it off the scapula. So I went in with my finger. And I was just digging at the back of the scapula, just trying to like peel it off and not rip it. And I got it off and it was great. Oh my gosh, I was so happy. So we have both serratus, um, superior, posterior muscles totally preserved, except the one on the right is cut off from the spine. I think eventually we will have to cut the other one there. Um, it looks really nice. Uh, you can totally see everything. Um, a few of our, it was kind of tough trying to get the latissimus dorsi muscles off because those were really thin too. And we couldn't tell what was latissimus dorsi and what wasn't. And then the trapezius muscles were also kind of hard to get off, kind of the same situation. Um, but once we got into those deeper muscles, we were able to preserve them a little bit better. So it's definitely hard to dissect. Um, and you gotta make sure you kind of know what you're looking for. Um, but we did a pretty good job. So I'm in my scrubs. Very cute.
and uh, I'm sweating like crazy because it's so hot outside and I was working at that muscle pretty hard. So I'm going to go change. I'm sorry, I just hallucinated. What? pizza it would stay more dry <laughs> updated in a while so it's eight o'clock um i'm just now leaving the cadaver lab um so we were in there uh just studying we have a lab practical tomorrow our first lab practical very exciting um it's mainly exciting just because it doesn't seem that hard <laughs> there are some things that are really hard to identify like the differences between nerves and arteries is really tough um but other than that We've gone over it all in our lecture exam, so I feel pretty good about it. I was actually able to look at a lot of different bodies, which was very cool. So different than the one that we are on, um, but really cool. Just a once in a lifetime experience for sure. This is really fun. And <gasps> sunshine. <laughs> um, I got an A on my lecture today, or my lecture, I got an A on my lecture exam today um, for one of our classes, so it's also 90 degrees outside, so I am treating myself to some ice cream.
Good morning. I'm off to go get my first not A of the summer semester. I'd like to cry. Have a good day. Cadaver lab takes dedication. <laughs> Definitely some nerves tripped me up, but it wasn't really that bad. Now I am going to go chat with my advisor um, about some stuff, maybe schedule some classes. physical therapy building or just the brewer science building to go study for my exam that is at 8 45 and then we spend the whole day in lab i'm running on five hours of sleep 
Bye. Anatomy one in one box. Now I'm done. I just took my final and it wasn't horrible. I hope. But I'm done. Two more exams tomorrow and sweet freedom. Uh. I know I was sucking too hard. <laughs>